if this condition is true, then do this. Else, if this condition is true, if you are a programmer like me, or anyone who sits for long hours and wanted to start working out but don't know where to start, this video is for you. Three, four. I will show you some basic calisthenic exercise that you can do maybe on your lunch break or whenever you have free time. Let's start with scapular protraction and retraction. This exercise will help you strengthen your back muscles and help you with fixing your posture whenever you are debugging your code. Just simply pull your scapula together for retraction and push to separate them apart for protraction. Repeat this motion until you get comfortable before moving to the next exercise. Next is the wrist warm up to avoid injuries. Now to the other side. Do this on each side for at least 10 seconds. Bended knee push up with scapula protraction, retraction motion. If you can't do a full push up yet, you can try bended knee push ups until you build up your strength. This is to make scapula exercise more effective by adding weight to the motion. Remember to tuck your elbows in, posterior pelvic tilt, back straight, and no lower back arching. If you are confident enough with your bent knee push-ups, you can now go to the next level, normal push-ups. For the exercises you've been waiting for, core muscle exercises. Remember to read the instructions above. Are you still okay? Good. Remember to breathe on this exercise. Remember to do some stretching after that exercise. This is a harder variation of this exercise. can't do the harder variations yet, don't worry, you can do this variation instead. For your lower back exercise, lie down, slowly lift your glutes while squeezed. Do this exercise slowly. It took me years just to get comfortable with these exercises. As a programmer, these exercises help me a lot in keeping my body healthy and help me with discipline that I apply to my coding. I hope you learned something on my video. For more tutorials and tips, please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.